I'd be perfectly happy never again setting foot in the Winter Palace. It wasn't the gossip and backstabbing, I know what the game entails, but the indifference to it all. I didn't care for it myself. I shouldn't be surprised. The Chantry can be the same. Their politics are less extravagant, but just as heated. Gaspard rules a country. The divine influence is half a continent. Another time, then. There are spirits hovering by the veil to observe the thrones of powerful nations. The machinations, betrayals. After our time in Halam Shirao, I understand why. I had forgotten how I missed court intrigue. You miss court intrigue? When were you at court? Oh, well, never directly, of course. An elven apostate is rarely invited to speak with empresses and kings. But from the Fade, I have watched dynasties form and empires crumble. It is sometimes savage, sometimes noble, and always fascinating. In any event, Gaspar should be a steadfast ally. Briala will keep him in check, and look after the elves. I hope Briala is able to use her position to help our people. Our people? Who are? Oh, you mean elves? I'm sorry, I was confused. I do not consider myself to have much in common with the elves. do you have much in common with? Who are your people? A good question. I joined the Inquisition to save the world. Regardless of who my people are, this was the best way to help them. As for the Elves of Orlay, I believe Briala is doing quite well on their behalf. She is an admirable woman. You're an admirable man. Not many people know who they are the way you do. Thank you. Both for saying that and for seeing that. Few in this world can see me, instead of just seeing a pair of pointed ears. <laughs>